Hi guys, it's been a while. To be exact, it's 107 days without golf here in my country. Pretty bad shape with the current COVID situation here. Well, the golf sectors have reopened now. That's the most exciting thing for me. So, today will be my first official game. I did went to the range trying to polish off my rustiness and managed to get a few holes under my belt yesterday. And hopefully, everything goes well today. Also, I will be teeing off for the first time at this exclusive course today. It's literally flat and the greens are a bit slow. Hopefully, this will help me to restore some fate on my swing. Teeing off on the 10 today, a long par 5. It's 500 meters. The fairway is pretty big here and the big boys will be out. I hit it pretty solid here, off to a good start. Hitting a hybrid here, trying to get a decent distance to the green for my approach shot. It's not a solid one, but I will take it from here. So for my third shot, I managed to strike this perfectly, leaving myself 10 feet for birdie. I'm expecting the green to be slower because it's still early in the morning and two part will be a great start. Of course, I will try my best to put this into the hole. Definitely a momentum push for me. Fortunate for my part to drop and I'm one under through one. Second hole of the day is a decent par 4 dog leg right, 386 meters, and I pull that to the left. I'm trying to get it over the trees, but somehow I dafted the shot. It is slightly short of the green, I still have some work to do. Pretty decent uphill chip, but I overdo it. Some of the rust which I still need some time on it. Hey, it's 4 months without chipping. Can't expect much. So I'm going for my par now. It's a downhill part which I have put too much concern over the speed and this is not a good spot to be in. Pretty much got a feeling I will three part from here. I screw up my first part and I'm 3.5 feet away from the hole. And this is not a good sign to start off with. What makes me frustrated is I missed this short part as well and for a double. So I'm 1 over through 2, still got plenty more golf to be played, nothing to be frustrated about. Up next is a dog leg par 4, it's a very short one, it's about 330 meters. I will be teeing off with my 3 iron to place it somewhere near the 100 meters marker for my approach shot. A solid swing here, managed to find the fairway. It's about 130 meters to the pin and I actually topped my 9 iron. Pretty bad chip here, still left myself about 25 feet to the pin for par. I won't be expecting much here. A two part, I will move on with it. A decent bogey, so I'm two over through three. Moving to the fourth hole. On to the fourth hole is a par three, 175 meters to the pin, and I'm using a six iron. The pin is stuck right, so I'm aiming the center of the green. Yeah. 
this is a long 40 feet birdie part and I'm happy with two parts here. My very first par for today and I'm still two over through four holes. On to the fifth hole. It was supposed to be a par four but due to some major revamping here, we are playing a temporary green here today. So it will be a temporary par three for now. 185 meters to the pin, off with a 6 iron. Wasn't a solid shot, but it's still acceptable. It's front of the green, and I have some work to do. Managed to get a great chip here, and get off with another par. So, I'm still 2 over through 5, moving on to the 6. On to the 6 hole, handicap 4 hole, a decent 390 meters par 4. Hit it pretty straight down the middle of the fairway. Left myself about 80 meters in for my second. Trying to get one close in for a birdie chance. I hit it quite solid and it bounces off the green. For my control shot, yet to get back my fuel for the time being. Definitely a good up and down here to secure another par for today. So I'm still 2 over through 6. Moving on to the next hole. Honestly speaking, I'm playing better than I expected. Hopefully my hot streak will continue and breaking 80 will be possible. Moving on to the 7th hole, 340 dog leg left, par 4, yeah. just trying to put myself in the middle of the fairway. For my approach, I'm using a wedge in about 115 meters. Nothing fancy here, just aiming center green. I think I pull it to the left slightly. I'm off the green. As you can see, I dafted my chip here. Not really confident with it yet. This is partly the mental side because I was thinking I might top it due to the lie of the ball. A good recovery here avoided a big number on my scorecard. So I'm 3 over through 7 now, moving on to the next hole, which is a par 3, 172 meters. Teeing off with a 7 iron here, pretty straightforward hole. There is some tailwind here, eventually my ball flew further than I expected. I'm off the back of the green here. It's a 20 meter chip, needed to get up and down here, slightly downhill. Hoping to make this par, but there's a leap up once again, resulting in a bogey, and I'm 4 over through 8 now. Moving on to the 9th hole, it's a par 5, 520 meters, pretty straight par 5, just need to be on the fairway. Very fortunate, my snap actually hit one of the branches there, and it came out into the middle of the fairway. 
my flight mate actually advised me to lay up because there is a pawn on the right side so taking out my 8 iron to make sure that i'm in place once again i should have chosen a longer club because this approach is about 160 meters left it's not short i'm using a 7 iron here trying to place it in the middle of the green Another great opportunity for birdie here. A very decent par here after a poor drive on the tee box. And I'm 4 over through 9, moving on to the second 9. Onto the 10 hole, this is a par 5, a long one, and I pull my drive once again, more like a hook here, landed on the next fairway. Trying to keep it in play by hitting a 9 iron back onto the fairway. I'm pulling all my shot to the left today, still trying to figure out my swing. This is the best I can do after 4 months. On to the 11 hole, it's a 375 meters par 4 slightly dog leg right and i'm going with a tray iron i hope you will enjoy my video if you have not subscribed do subscribe now like and comment and share it among your friends i should have aimed for the right but partly because i'm playing the first time here so this is a slight disadvantage for me well i managed to hit a perfect second shot here the ball landed about 15 feet from the hole. It's an opportunity for me to get one back here and I miss it. I'm happy with the par and let's move on. On to the 12 is a uphill par 3, 150 meters. Going with the 8 iron. The ball landed right behind the green. This is a long hole where I use the shortcut here, cutting across the tree. 155 meters to the green and I'm using an 8 iron. I expect myself to make this buddy, but... On to the 14 hole, it's a par 3, 172 meters. And I'm using a 7 iron here, partly because of the tailwind. Nothing better than a palm. Two part is a must. Securing another par, so I'm 6 over through 14 holes. On to the next hole, which is the 15 hole, 477 meters, par 5, dog leg to the right.
I'm left with about 210 meters going with a tray iron. Yes, I pull it once again to the left. Hopefully, I can have a good chip here to set up a good birdie. It's definitely a momentum push for me for the final few holes. On to the 16 hole, it's a short path ball again, it's only 330 meters, going with a 3 iron. Definitely one of the worst swing I had today. Hopefully my ball is still there. It's never an easy shot being under the tree. Sometimes we make it tough, trying to do some fancy shot here by creating a draw. The simpler way to hit it out, play for 3 on and try to save a path. Definitely something to do with my ego here, thinking I'm Tiger Woods. So my third shot ended up on the green side bunker. A few consecutive bad shot here, could be an easy 5 but with such a complex mindset, I'm running into trouble yet again. Going for my bogey here. Causing me a double bogey here. Huh? On to the 17th hole. I'm just trying to put myself in play. It's a solid 3 iron and it's on the middle of the fairway. It's a severe dog leg left. 411 meters par 4. Eventually, I got blocked by a bunch of trees. Ego kicks in, trying to duck hook in and top the ball. Pure stupidity mindset here once again, trying so hard to play good golf. I got lucky here, have a gap in between, and I'm going for my third now. This is about 75 meters to the edge of the green, and I managed to find the front part of it. Using a 52 wedge here, hoping for a good chip and move on with a bogey. It's a gimme. So I'm currently 9 over, needed a birdie on the last to break 80. Standing on the very last tee box of the day, it's a 365 meters par 4. One of the widest fairway here, and I'm taking out my big dog, booming my drive down the fairway. After using my bush now, it is about 67 meters to the pin, and I have decided to use a 56 wedge for my approach. The best approach I managed to hit all day, leaving myself a solid 4 footer for buddy. This is for my buddy to break 80. I pushed it. So, finishing with a par here with a total score of 80. No complaints since it was my first game after 4 months, till then stay safe.